Good day. How are you? It is February 22nd, Thursday, 2024. And this is your Rainbow Trout Stocking Report. And I want to start off by first asking for your forgiveness, apologies. I missed yesterday. And also, I am fighting off some junk. So uh, if you find it difficult to understand, don't worry. Uh, if you haven't noticed already, uh, previously, I do have the content that I share here in the description under the video below. So you'll find links to things I talk about and then all of the information for locations we're covering. So that said, I'm combining yesterday, Wednesday, the 21st report with today, Thursday, the 22nd report. So again, just forgive me. Here we go. For yesterday, the 21st, we had Lake Friendswood in Friendswood receiving 1,600 trout for the last stocking of the season. Moving over to Tom Bass 3, not too terribly far from Friendswood, we're expected, we expected 1,100 trout for the last stocking of the season there. Um, I just wanted to make a little note that that's, that's pathetic. Um, they stocked that place twice with 1,100 trout or that's what we're guessing they did because they had 2,200 for the total number to be stocked and then they were doing it in two different uh, dates. That place is huge. That place is very deep. Uh, that is one of the lakes I know that the trout can live. They can survive year round because the water's deep enough and the temperatures stay cool enough for them to do so. And in years past, I've seen you know anywhere from 3,500 to 5,000, 5,500 trout stocked in that body of water. So. Again, I'm gonna. I'm. I don't know, but I, I'm. I'm curious, and I want to know. I want want to share for my channel's sake the reasons for how they determine how many fish go to each location. I don't know if the city pays for it. I don't know if it has to do with the funding for the trout program or what. I want to dig into it and find out. Moving on, I digress. Apologies. In Kilgore, Texas, we have Elder Lake estimated a thousand fish a little over a thousand fish for the last stocking of the season now let's move to today's stockings thursday the 22nd back to grafford texas we are going to wrap up the stockings there in at the possum kingdom tail race with a little over 1200 trout for the last stocking this season that that's one of the locations that got hit man a lot of fish were poured in there but so today we wrapped up moving over to somerville we have Blue Stem Pond with a measly 200 trout for your only stocking this season. That must be like a little water hole. Um, I'm not familiar with it. Lastly, to round out our reports, to Waco we go for Noro, uh, sorry, Nora Pond, 500 trout only stocking there this season as well. So again, I combined the last two days. I missed you yesterday. My apologies. Um, I do have all of the information you need to know listed in the description below. So keep in mind that the stockings usually take place anywhere from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m., although the times and the dates can vary. All of the information you need for being legal for targeting these trout I have in the information below. And I even made a resource for you, a video resource that you can check out where I share um, recommendation on gear rods and reels tackle um bait lures that sort of thing sorry i'm just i'm not feeling well today guys and um just last reminder that the parks and wildlife will be stocking up into the beginning of march so we still have a couple weeks to go so thanks for tuning in today thanks for bearing through my graveliness and um my apologies again for missing you yesterday, but I will see you very soon. I do believe tomorrow's report is another big one, but uh, we'll get to it. We'll get to it. We'll see you when we get to it. All right. Have a good one. Take care. Bye-bye.